the Battle of Uhud, which was a significant event in the early history of Islam. The battle took place on 23rd March 625 CE, near the city of Medina in present-day Saudi Arabia. The battle was fought between a Muslim army led by Prophet Muhammad and a Meccan army led by Abu Sufyan. The Meccan army had marched to Medina seeking revenge for their defeat in the Battle of Badr, which had taken place the previous year. The battle initially went well for the Muslims, with the Meccan army being driven back. However, a group of Muslim archers disobeyed the Prophet Muhammad's orders and left their position on a hill allowing the Meccan cavalry to attack the Muslims from behind. This led to a turning point in the battle, with many Muslim casualties and Prophet Muhammad himself being injured. Despite their losses, the Muslims were able to regroup and repel the Meccan attack, forcing them to withdraw. The battle was considered a setback for the Muslims, but they were able to learn from their mistakes and continue to grow as a military and political force. The Battle of Uhud remains an important event in Islamic history, and its lessons continue to be studied and applied in contemporary contexts. The lesson that we should learn from this event is that we should fight or strive for God and not for this world. It was shown to the people that they have the love of this world, which is why they could not win decisively in this battle. Therefore, after becoming Muslims, we should not think that our job is done. Rather, we should think that we have to maintain this Iman till we die, and therefore work for it persistently. Like praying five times, observing fasts in Ramzan, always speaking the truth, fighting injustice, etc.